we will spend a few minutes secretary is on we will spend a few minutes uh, going over the things we i told you last time so sort of review for for a few minutes so what we are talking about signal flow graph normal control system configuration is like this what we can do we can represent this diagram like this also instead of doing the block diagram concept we can do it so something like this and this is what is called the signal flow graph what is this this contains and i told you the definition of uh, signal flow graph contains branches showing the transfer function okay and the branches are directed directed branches just to show how the signal is flowing and these are nodes so the input is again this is the input node then this is the output output node and this is what is branch okay so uh, this is the this is the way we say and i give you a formal definition also signal flow graph a diagram consisting of just consisting of nodes and branches so this is the diagram of signal flow graph for this system so and what is the advantage it advantage is that you don't have to draw the boxes and some junctions and this and this okay we just represent it through some uh, lines and, and so on so on. okay so that signal flow graph then i told you what is a node this is a node this is a node this is a source node this is a sink node there are also some nodes called which are mixed for example this one last time i showed you this diagram this node is a mixed node yes okay. it's, uh, it's not a source node it's not a sink node so it is also source for this part it is seeing what this part so this is called a mixed mixed node right i mean what again a number of boolean again anyway uh, these are easy things okay so y is a x and here y is comes from two things a times x and b times c usual block diagram procedure but simple much much simpler drawings okay then i told you what is a path and then i said what is a loop you understood loop uh, one he was looking for something some information about the loop so one do you understand a loop जीटिंग and this is the other node these two loops are touching why because there is a common node here for this for this loop and for this loop there is a common node here there is a common node that's why they are touching okay consider this loop this loop and this loop are non touching because there is nothing common this doesn't touch this one well if you brought this here if there was no b if you brought it here then it would be touching okay so just like physical touch okay this is one loop and this is another loop they are isolated this this just away sometimes you may be tricked remember sometimes you may be tricked this to be let's say if i write one things are going to be quite quite different one doesn't mean anything one means uh, this signal and this signal are the same so if you put one here this loop will be touching this one as well as this one okay so remember non touching and to make non touching so there must be something in between other than one okay ekhon bujhte pareche babu one sir okay and then we needed this touching non touching concept to get the overall transfer function and i told you what is mason's rule this rule you memorize okay this is a rule the overall transfer function is k1 to n tk delta k divided by delta n is the number of forward paths and pk is the gain of the forward path so if there are three paths k will be k will be 1 2 3 okay and then p1 is that this p will pk will be 3 p1 p2 p3 and p1 will be the gain in uh, gain in the path one okay so i was explaining to you all this and if you have problem if you face problem you speak up simply you speak up you have this you have the microphone you can turn it on and draw my attention there are other ways of drawing attention also okay so uh, and then i told you this is the path gain and this is the system determinant this is very useful this is the important part okay and once you understand this this is not 
big problem. I told you, I explained to you. So delta is the, this this formula. You got to remember this. Uh, delta is called the graph determinant. Is one minus sum of all root gains. And then you look you look for loops, non-touching pairs of loops. So this will be this is minus and plus and, and minus. That's the way it goes. Minus plus minus. Okay. So this part is sum of all loop gains, and this part is loop gains of pairs of loops not touching each other. Pair of loops not touching each other, and you sum all these possibilities. Okay. So this is what it is. And then this is triplet three loops not touching each other, and then uh, quadruplets four groups not touching each other like this and also i told you suppose this thing is not there this one is not there only uh, they are not touching pairs not touching pairs then if this term is not there then you don't have to look for any further term okay if if you find one possibility zero then you don't have to look for that okay if this is not satisfied this will never be satisfied okay then i solved some examples for you two examples i did Okay, we see here. Uh, our question is find y over r. Y over r. Okay. Now, in your examination, if this diagram may not be given to you. The diagram may be given in block diagrams. Okay, and then you will be asked to find y over r in block diagrams. So you can do block diagram reduction, or you have the option of drawing the signal flow graph. Okay, I will show you with my example later. Okay, in this case, you have to find y over r and then what do we do? We look into the formula. We go into this formula. We start looking at how many forward paths. Okay. So how many forward paths we had? We found only one forward path from R to Y. There is only one path. Okay. So there will be only P1. Okay. Uh, and what will be delta? Delta is one minus summation of loop gains. And I, I told you that we have four loops here. One, two, three. And that's the fourth one. So some of these four loops is here. Okay. And then you look for this is minus. And then you put plus and you look for triplets. If there are triplets, three loops not touching each other. Three loops, combination of three loops not touching each other. And you've got one combination. This loop, this loop, and this loop, they are not touching each other. So what will you write? You will write bi times dj times fk. This is one combination, and I will wrote this. Bj B I D J uh, B I D J okay B I D J and F K three of them together. Do we have any more? Okay, no, we, 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 we did not do the pairs first. First of all, we have to do the pairs and then we'll go to the triplets. Triplets will come later. So what we'll do one minus sum of all the loop gains. One, two, three, and four. So these are the four. One, two, three, four. Then we look at pairs, not touching each other. How many pairs? We found last time. We said this this one and this one does not touch each other. This one and this one does not touch each other. So this one and this one does not touch each other. So three combinations. Pairs of loops. First one will be B Y B I D J. Second one will be B I F K. Third one will be DJFK, and that's what it is. You see that one minus this, and then plus this quantity. Okay, is three, and then after that we have done pairs, and then we go to triplets. So for triplet, there will be only one term. BI DJFK together, BI DJFK, and they also, remember the signs go alternately: one minus, then plus, then minus. And this is P1. How do we find delta 1? Anybody remembers how we find delta 1? Last time I told you. Anybody remembers how uh, we. Uh, forward part third, remove for the third. We have to, we have to erase this forward path. So if you are talking about you want to find delta 1, then remove, remove the path P1 or erase the path P1. And then look at the diagram. This is a new diagram. And look at it and see. And for this new diagram, apply again, find delta. Okay. For this new diagram, we have, with all these connections going, look at this diagram and find delta. That delta will be delta 1. Okay. 
and we can see that if you raise this, there is no loop. So it is only one. That's it. That's only one. There is no loop. So the, if there is no loop, you don't have even this term. Okay. Delta is one minus no loop, so zero. I don't have to go bother about any of these things. So delta one is one. This is one example I did for you. The second example. Anybody needs me to explain the second example again? Students, are you okay? I'll give you another two, three minutes to go over it and come back to me. If you did not understand, I'll do it again. And if you did understand, then there is no need for me to go over it. Okay. Everybody happy? Everybody happy? As a, as a smaller class today, it's only 35 students so far. So, we look for forward paths 1, 2, P1, P2. And we look for the delta, so P1, P2. P1 is this, gain all of this, P2 is this, gain all of it. And then we find delta. Delta for delta, we look at loops. How many loops are there? Four loops. One, two, three, four. So one minus put all these four loops. Okay, we want to, to find delta, and then we find loops not touching each other. So we see that this one doesn't touch this one, this one doesn't touch this one, this one does not touch this one, and this one does not touch this one. So there are four possibilities not touching each other. Okay, so four possibilities. Four L1, L3. That's what I told you, L1, L3, and then L1, L4. L1, remember L1 is G2, H2. So if you want to write the entire thing, then you write G2, H2 times G, G6, H6. Or if you say, if you declare ahead of time that this is L1, then for, for making it shorter, we can write like this. L1, L3, L1, L4, L2, L3, L2, L4. And there is no triplet. There, there are no groups. Set of three, not touching each other. You see that, right? You do not find a single triplet here. So triplet zero, triplet is zero, and we do not have to bother about anything about that. So, and delta one, delta one was erase P1, and then look at the new diagram. Find the delta, okay? And then we found this. All of you did join with delta one, one minus L3, L4. Because if you erase this, these loops are going to be there. Okay. If you erase this path, these loops are not going, not, not going to be affected. So one minus this loop, this loop gain, and this loop gain. Okay. So look at that. And there will be no more terms. There is no question of uh, one touching pairs or triplets or anything like this. So that's the way we get delta one. And for delta two, we erase this path and repeat this. If you repeat this, you, you understand that this one similar. So we get delta 2 is 1 minus L1 plus L2. Put all of them together. This is your overall transformation. Y over R, P1 delta 1 plus P2 delta 2 divided by delta. P1 delta 1, P2 delta 2 divided by delta. So if you're a good student, you at this point, okay, fine, you're doing like this. At this point, write one more step and substitute, say, for L1. L1 is G2, H2, write this. L2 is G3, H3. That is going to be better, okay? But if you left it here also, I don't think we will punish you. But then, uh, as I said, why should Y over R, it's preferable that you write in terms of G's and H's. There are some, already, already there is some things, okay? So if the whole thing is in terms of G and H, that makes better sense. Okay, we will come back to this example later, maybe. Talk about it later. Now, let's give you an example, good example, beautiful example for you to see. So, this is a diagram given to you. This is a block diagram. The question is find y over x. Okay. So, you have the option and if the question doesn't tell you any method, 
then you can use block diagram reduction or you can uh, draw signal flow graph for this one and then solve the problem you have either of them if it is specifically mentioned that you use signal flow graph then you have to draw the signal flow graph of this so i am putting both of them on the screen see see look at this this block diagram is represented by this signal flow graph take a look at it and see how many of you understand or how many of you don't understand this diagram this is a block diagram and this is the signal flow graph for this diagram everybody take everybody i give you five minutes time just to see how it is done and whether you understand what is what has been done sir amader attendance link ta ki off kore dewa hoyeche it will be abhi to modhe chat e diye diyechi it will be at the end of the class attendance i open at the end of the class uh the students come some some students i'm not saying everybody i try to not be blaming all the students only there are some students and it's a significant number they come click and then leave that's it because yesterday uh it not yesterday was it yesterday last class everybody was telling in my class it was never more than 100 i am checking the numbers I'm checking the numbers কেন আমি কালকে ক্লাসে ব্লাস্ট ক্লাসে আমি দেখেছি যে নাম্বার অফ স্টুডেন্টস ওয়ার নেভার মোর দ্যান 100 100 102 সামথিং লাইক দিস এন্ড দেন ইট স্টার্টেড ইনক্রিজিং আফটার আ ওয়াইল ইট কেম ডাউন বাট আই লুক এট দ্য অ্যাটেন্ডেন্স শেড এন্ড এভরিবডি ইজ প্রেজেন্ট অলমোস্ট এভরিবডি ইজ প্রেজেন্ট সো ইটস নট ওয়ার্কিং ইউ নো উই হ্যাড দ্য সিস্টেম চেঞ্জড ফর ইউ টু গো ক্লিক হিয়ার নট অটোমেটিক অটোমেটিক অ্যাটেন্ডেন্স অলসো স্টুডেন্টস কাম এন্ড দেন দে লিভ no I, i i don't mind all this but I, what i'm saying that there are some serious students who come to the class they try to understand they listen and then so they have to be discriminated against they have to be discriminated from the students who are just cheating right this is 10 marks as for students who attend the class regularly and also uh, and some other things like uh, homeworks and sms and things like this but On a, on a system like this, on a platform like this, it's uh, useless to give you assignments. Because assignments are going to be photocopies from each other. So, the stand marks is exclusively, exclusively now for attendance. And we, I don't want to give away this mark, or you don't want me to give away this mark to just anybody who will never come to the class and will get 10. Right? Because the students are, the, it is only for deserving students who are deserving, who are present. So what we'll do uh, after the class, after the class, I close this and then I open that link, and that will be open for 10 minutes if necessary, 15 minutes, and, and then I close it. So if if some people only come at the end of the class and then do it, I cannot stop it. But you see, uh, I, I, this may be minimized. I don't know. Yeah. So so okay. Does it answer your attendance question, everybody? At the end of the class, I'll close this and then I'll open the attendance link for you. Okay, and then you can click and go to do other business. Now, this is what I told you. Now, remember this diagram. I told you this. This is a di block diagram for a control system. Do you? Have? You have been asked to find y over x. This is the question. Find y over x or find the overall transformation. Whatever way it is it is asked. So if the question is just like that, find y over x, just like that, then you have the option to do block diagram reduction or draw signal flow graph of this and use Mason's tool. But if the question told you specifically use block diagram reduction, then you don't have this. Or in this case, it says find y over x using Mason's tool. 
So this question is asking you to draw the signal program and then find y values. So what is there? This is the block diagram and this is the signal program. There is not much to explain to you. You have to understand yourself. So try, see if you understand this diagram. That's what I ask you. So I'll wait for a few minutes for you, for all of you, to see that you understand it. Okay, is there anybody is there anybody in the class who that who does not understand this diagram? How this diagram has come to this? If you say yes, only then I'll explain. If you do not say anything, I will not explain it. If you don't say anything, if you just saying it, just turn on the microphone and then talk with me. Uh, if you did not know how uh -huh. this diagram uh, oh, uh, sir, if you have a wire diagram, you can see the wire diagram. You can see the wire diagram. Why is the output known? Why is the output known? Why is the output known? Let me show you. Why is the output known? 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 Why so this signal and this signal are being added. That's what it says. So, so why node a why node is a signal that has the summation from two. This one, this one, this is this one, and this one. And this one is what? This one is this one. So more advantages of the draw for itself. So some of this signal plus this signal, this is why. Some of this signal plus this signal, this is one. It's very so. So it's so it's simply one node. Again, you note that the two node the big view of one over one. A note that the two are arched are at a very very easy. A note that the whole thing is one node. And the key is an actor signal arched input, arched signal input, arched full of the parity. Two are arched at a very easy. All right. The core is one question as an egg was it? The show should be the other one. X take a summation junction to S. X take a sum hollow a signal to R Y take S. The data sum for sum of the two. The data sum for the two is the X or the Jow. The layer is the height of the Jow. The layer you have to put something like this and show one here. That means X is here. Okay. So you are putting X here and then Y. X and Y. Because you would say a note to the issue. So this is this mode. You are talking about X and Y. So uh, this one should not confuse you, okay? It says only it is not drawing a sugar in the number of this. So, a therefore, and the head will be signal to the data joke or for a guest, and I shall go as the Avaraka signal joke. Therefore, if it is a signal joke, it is a signal to it. It is our put it, it is being taken. So, this signal is being taken, and then it is being added with minus C. Minus C, this is minus C. Uh, this is being added with minus from this node. So these nodes are here. This node is and this node is here. This one, this node, and this node is here. This node and this node is here. Okay, so that's the way. Uh, I will not do the that the connection to the layer system only can be not the node to the air system. not the node to the air system. You not the node to the B system. Enter negative will look at us, sita. Uta, sita. We didn't get minus with a negative feedback. The two ways you can watch this. In the minus as a two, so I'm using a packet near to be a minus. 
So the whole thing is minus c. Then yeah, c with minus sign. C with minus sign. You can tell them it's easier. Block diagram will do more shape. Take a table of them. Block diagram is plus a minus b minus c. Don't get into the problem. Problem is physical diagrams. Okay, physical blocks. I can do the signal signal through representation. You are representing it. the whole thing is c with minus sign. So minus. C. Okay. तुम्हें पारित के बुशे देखो जे whether you can solve this problem with the methods you learned so far block diagram reduction पुरे पुरे देखो it's not that simple तुम्हें तुम्हारा ऑप्शन समय ये जो ट्राई करे देख रहे it's not that simple but then if you if you did draw the single program ये देखो this very simple ये होते हैं क्या ने तुम्हें यहाँ मिसमेशन सुलझ रहा है तो मिसमेशन सुलझे देख रहे जे वही जे बोलूँ कि समेशन PK delta K, PK number of forward paths. What a forward path is here? Who will do it? Tell me, Mira. Here, here, forward path. What is it? Forward path. X T K Y put it. What is it? Right T. Right T. Ah, two. Two, sir. Two, sir. Two, sir. Yes. Ah, two forward paths. One and the other one. So there is P one and P two. P one is A B, and P two is C K. Okay. So there will be delta one and delta two. But if delta one is two for a for a two, but we know now that there is P one is this, and P two is this. Delta one, delta two, we do for it. So one of the important things for us to find is delta. Okay, we have to find delta. How do you find delta? Go to the same equation again. Mason rule one minus minus summation of loop base. What are loops? See, look at this. Loop what is it? How many loops are here? One minus sum of all different loop gates, all loops. That for example, they will not touching pair. That for they will not touching triplet. That for they will not touching quadruplet. Okay. So, what I'm, what I'm talking about is loops, quadruplet loop as well. You have to be careful in saying it. You have to be careful in that kind of way. Loop and loop, they have to. What is what is this? Two types. Two types. So, okay, two types. So, then, two types. What is it? Then, I'm going to tell you two types. फिर आवर और की और पे एक ले जी सर तीन टा सर तीन और विषय से नहीं चार आसन है कि एनी बुडी फॉर फोर चार इन पावर एक होने चाहिए ना दूसरी चार तीन चार फॉर्च्यूनेटली इस वन ऑफ दिस करेक्ट ऐसा ना मैं जो दी क्लास हुई तो दिलाए मैं हाथ तोड़ के बोलता हूँ आई आई तोड़ सी द हैंड्स एंड दें Three loops. Anyway, I mean, if I am not there, I will do it. We can do it. Loops. The actor loop all that. So then, the actor A B C minus A B C. R K loop is R S A B. So minus sign. So minus A B. You can piece it, man. Why? A B C with the minus sign. Minus A B C. It is A times B. माइनस है माइनस है भी और लास्ट लूप टा कौन था लास्ट लूप टा होलो ये खाते के बी ए ए डी बी की ए ए डी बी की ए ए जी का वो ए जी की लास्ट वो ये क्या क्यों उस तरह से थर्ड लूप टा जब दूसरा बोली सिले थर्ड जन्म बोल सी यार इधर लूप ही है वो मिस एनीथिंग खाते के क्यों ये ये वन Okay, there is something like this. This this is make one loop. And what is the loop gain? Loop gain what? Minus a. Minus a. So these are the three. These are the three. Minus a b c minus a b minus. Ah, are you sure? Say, come on. Are there pairs of loops not touching each other? We can't really see that. We can't really see that. We just see the loop below. We can't see the loop below. Not touching, I said. Not touching, I said. Only touch, correct. 
অসুবিধা হয় there will be no loops. If you don't use it out, there will be no loops left. Okay. So delta 2 is 1, and the answer is P1 delta 1 plus P2 delta 2 over delta 2. And this is the... So with, uh, with your experience increasing, then you will see that this is much simpler compared to this one. And so I am, sug I am suggesting that take this diagram, use block diagram reduction techniques, and see if you find this, find this one, okay? So take it as a homework for yourself. But there is no need to submit, because uh, I, once I ask you to submit, then this is not a problem. But this is a homework for you, that find y over x with the help of block diagram reduction. And then you will be able to appreciate the contrast with the contrast with the Okay. Uh, This is a, simply a makeup class, and the students are mm. coming very slowly. Very slowly, 68 students now. First time I had 100 about that, and in the beginning we had I had about 130 at one at one time, and the number is simply dwindling. Dwindling is getting smaller and smaller. So. Uh, Sir, so, uh, so, uh, so, so, uh, so, Classroom is a very good thing. I have to do this. 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 Yeah, I mean, so, uh, anyway, uh, yeah. uh, uh, okay. uh, uh, okay. So, I'm not sure if you're a I'm not sure if you're a student. I'm not sure if you're a student. I'm not sure if you're a student. I'm not Sir, attendance did the point of Google for me. I'm taking it. You are not, you are not absent. You are still there. But do play the recorded deck. I don't want to fill up for that. I don't fill up for that. I don't want to fill up for that. that means in that case, what will happen? The the students will. The actor thing is, what is one class as an one class still? Ah, uh, yes sir. Actor thing is, one class still one class. 
কিন্তু তোমাদের যে মেসেজ দিয়েছি তো যে একটা থেকে তাই না সো এমন যদি কোনো ক্লাস না থাকে তো ইউ শুড ট্রাই টু আপ এন্ড দেন দিস ওয়ান গোইং টু ওয়ান টু ওয়ান ওয়ান্স হোয়াটএভার ইট ইজ আই গেভ ইউ দা মেসেজ আই গেভ ইউ দা দি ইনফরমেশন দ্যাট দি ক্লাস উইল বি ফ্রম ওয়ান টু ওয়ান 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 স্টার্টিং এট ওয়ান টু সো দেয়ার ইজ নো রিজন ওয়াই ইউ উইল নট গেট দ্যাট দিস দিস গোস এজ এন ইমেল দেন ওয়াজ দ্যাট সে দিস মেসেজ গোস এজ এন ইমেল সো ইউ শুড স্লিপ না স্যার প্রথমটা টাইম ছিল না প্রথমটা লেখা ছিল শুধু 7th জানুয়ারি তে ক্লাস হবে দেন আপনি আমাদের সাথে ডিসকাস করে 2 পিএম বলেছিলেন কিন্তু পরে এডিট করেছেন সেই এডিটটা আর আমাদের কাছে মেইল আসলো ওকে সো সো হোয়াট উইল ডু ইজ सिंपली তাহলে ধরেন যে देयर इज नो ক্লাস টুডে ওকে 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 Uh, this material this material what i told you we will repeat on monday again okay this material i will repeat as far as uh, uh, the understanding is concerned nobody is going to miss out and there will be no attendance to do it okay thank you sir all right everybody so that will make you happy i hope okay goodbye everybody assalam alaikum assalam alaikum sir assalam alaikum sir assalam alaikum